If you're planning on visiting London for business or pleasure, then you'll want to know the best places to stay. With so many options available, in this video, I'll share with you top three business hotels along with my top three quirky hotels for leisure travel. If you're traveling for business, you want a hotel with great options for hosting and attending business meetings, as well as high quality amenities. These three hotels in the heart of London offer a selection of amenities you might may need as a business traveler, as well as impeccable interiors to enjoy. For five-star luxury, contemporary interiors, and even a fitness center and steam room, the Andes Hotel on Liverpool Street is perfectly located for any business trip. You can dine at any of their five restaurants and bars on site, whether it's lunch at Reich's Cafe, Japanese cuisine at Mayako, or a more laid back dinner at Lady Abercorn's Pub and Kitchen. For business essentials, you can host your meetings in any of their 14 meeting rooms, which offer private dining, events, and conference rooms for up to 500 guests. For international business requirements, they offer hybrid meeting solutions. You can organize your all-in-one video conferencing so that everyone can join you. If you're having multiple meetings across town, the location is second to none. You're, you're right at Liverpool Station with extensive connections throughout London, and you're just a short walk to St. Paul's, Tower of London, Shoreditch, and even Old Street. The added bonus is they include free essential services including Wi-Fi, local calls, as well as mini bar drinks and snacks included in your room fee. Meanwhile, the basement Masonic Temple, a feature of the original railway hotel, is used for film screenings, fashion shows, and corporate events. For rooms, you can indulge with an Andes design suite equipped with a king-size separate bedroom plus open plan lounge and dining space. And if you're traveling for business but don't want to miss out on your fitness regime, there's also the unique fitness room which includes a Peloton bike, dumbbells, yoga equipment, and so much more. And there's even a wellness and personalized process available. If you want to enjoy uninterrupted views of London and satisfy your passion for art, then the M&E by Malia London at the Strand is a perfect choice. Located in the heart of the West End, you can get all of your business meetings done and also enjoy some of the best of London's entertainment. From theater to popular tourist attractions, including the Houses of Parliament, this is a great place to have as a base during your stay. The hotel is one of three London locations by the Arvin Guard Garden Designers, and you can also find the more traditional options at their Kensington Townhouse, as well as the White House based in Camden. Something that makes these hotels unique are the m and &E Studio Access. These are co-working locations where state-of-the-art technology, contemporary art and artist propositions merge together to give a different approach to normal meeting spaces. Latest technology, gadgets, lighting, and sound equipment blends with with artist propositions to transform meeting spaces into impressive venues. You can also host your conferences at the hotel where they offer an independent reception area and 500 square meters that can be divided up into seven individual spaces. If you don't want to leave the hotel for dining, you can visit the steak restaurant and cocktail round. There's also the radio rooftop bar with panoramic views of London's most iconic buildings and neighborhoods served up alongside inventive cocktails and tapas. The Strand location offers 16 unique suites as well as 157 rooms. Finally, if you're an international traveler coming to London from Europe and you want to jump off the Eurostar and into your room, then the Great Northern Hotel on Pancreas Road could be just the ticket. Located so close to the iconic station, you shouldn't be surprised to know that it is in fact London's first railway hotel. Opened in 1854, the hotel has had its ups and downs, but thanks to a recent 40 million renovation, it's been recreated into a place that's a classic hotspot for guests. You'll be pleased to hear that while it's also so close to the busy station, all the rooms are soundproofed. The rooms are a beautiful mix of contemporary style with hints to the building's Victorian railway heritage. They also provide a pantry with cakes, coffee, newspapers, even a USB printer on every floor so you don't have to head to the restaurant. If you want to dine, you can actually go to one of their three options on site. 
For meetings, there are three options, of all of which are luxurious and traditional in their interiors. They offer formal seating arrangements such as boardroom style, as well as private parties for dining options. King's Cross has recently become a hub of a technology, dining, and shopping, so it's a great space to have as a base when visiting. Home to Google headquarters of Pancras Square with restaurants and bars to enjoy. If you need to travel across London, you can jump on the underground from the station, including the Circle, Piccadilly, Hammersmith, Smith and City, Northern Metropolitan, and Victoria Lines. If you're traveling to London to take in the sights, relax, unwind, or simply enjoy some time off, then I've got three great hotels for the leisure travel. Obviously, there are loads of options depending on what you want, whether luxury, traditional, or quirky, so there'll be plenty to choose from. So here we're going to highlight one from each type so you can see the diversity we have on offer. If you want unique family and pet friendly experience, the Treehouse Hotel in Marleybond is a perfect option for your trip to London. The hotel provides its guests with rooms that feel cozy, nostalgic, and even have bay windows so you can sip coffee and watch the sunrise or sunset over London. For even better views, you can head to their rooftop bar with 360 degrees views of London. The bar also has a collection of cozy seats and sofas, as well as luscious ceiling installation of lights and plants, so you'll feel like you're in your own treehouse above London. If you want even more from your stay, they offer some fantastic packages to select from for your visit. I love the sound of the family tree package, which includes one overnight stay for a family of four in connecting rooms or up to five in a connecting clubhouse suite, lookout twin room. Breakfast in the California Mexican restaurant Madeira at Treehouse. Children's teepee set up in guest room prior to arrival. Welcome treat at the reception room on arrival. Milk and cookies, children's bathrobe and slippers, Treehouse coloring book, children's books and board games, children's bath amenities, complimentary cuts for babies, free Wi-Fi, and flexible 24-hour cancellation. Thanks to the location, you can easily visit family-friendly favorites like the London Zoo in Regent's Park, the British Museum, and renowned toy shop Hamleys. If a luxury stay in London with the spa treatments, decadent dining, and even chauffeur pickup ticks all your boxes, then the Beaumont Hotel in Mayfair is the hotel for you. Classic Art Deco styling is featured throughout the Grade 2 listed building and it doesn't mean you're missing out on modern luxuries. There are cozy public areas throughout this fine art filled hotel for you to stop by and relax and enjoy. For more relaxation, there's even a spa, haman, and hair salon on site. You can book a massage, facial, or haman treatments for men and women. You can also enjoy manicure and pedicure or visit the salon to get your blowout or that great London look. The Beaumont Spa also features a fully equipped gym, sauna, and steam room. With 50 rooms and 22 suites and studios, you can go all out on your luxury stay in London. It's located on a quiet garden square close to the boutique galleries and museums of Mayfair, St. James's, and the West End. If you want a night in, then you can dine at one of the restaurants or bars at the hotel itself. The Colony Grill is a New York style grill room with delicious steaks and salads, and there's American classics with cocktail and drinks. They've recently opened the Gatsby Room, which offers quintessential British afternoon tea to the soundtrack of piano music. If four poster beds, traditional interiors, and boutique experience is really what you're looking for, then you really must visit the Rookery in Farringdon. Fireplaces, deep and dark interiors, as well as plush fabrics and furnishings are packed into each room in this gorgeous boutique hotel. The conservatory has working fireplace, comfortable furnishings, and plenty to read after a long day walking around London. There's also Honesty Bar where you can relax and entertain friends while sipping on your favorite drinks. And if you're looking for access to London's most exclusive clubs, then their concierge service can sort you out. The 33 rooms are packed with personality as well as books, and each one is uniquely named after a character from Clerkenwell's past. There are two types of room choices to choose from, making it really simple. There's the Club Double and Double Superior, which are all air-conditioned, offering Wi-Fi and packed with personality. 
While there's no restaurant in the hotel, it's located perfectly for dining experiences galore. For example, Smithfield Market and St. John's Gate are right at your doorstep. You're also near one of London's hidden gems, the Church of St. Bartholomew the Great. It's London's oldest surviving church has been in continuous use since 1143. So will you be heading to London for business or pleasure? What did you think of my selections? Please leave us a comment or get in touch below. And if you're thinking about getting your perfect piece of London, make sure to get in touch. See you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to check out my other videos on my YouTube channel where I share great tips and information about the London property market and living in this fabulous city. So that's Ugo Orense with Onyx Property Team and Keller Williams. Bye for now.